What am I drawing? I'm drawing the particles in a Tyler. Solid. In a solid, excellent. In a solid, the particles are close together. They can't move freely, so they they can't move freely, so they should mark vibrate. vibrate. Excellent. If I added thermal energy to a solid, it would turn into a what? I am part of Teach for America. I was part of the 04 core in New York City. I taught in the South Bronx for two years. In my first year of teaching, I came to Team to Visit and it completely changed my life. I came with two other teachers who I was teaching with at my school and we left literally crying and just spent the entire day talking about how our world had changed and what we had thought was possible wasn't even close to what was possible and what we thought were high standards weren't even touching what high standards actually were. I feel like the charter movement can have a bigger impact in Newark than anywhere else. We have a lot of charter schools in a pretty small city in terms of urban areas in the country and it's one of the few places where there are enough charter schools that if we do it right we can actually make um, a change in the entire district. If we have the Bunsen burner on and the flame is going, it's burning up the gas, it's turning it into something else and it's perfectly safe. Almost every like class at Rise Academy is co-taught, so there are at least two teachers in the room. Often there are three teachers, sometimes in, um, even four, all working together for the exact same thing. Every day is professional development. Um, I've never been surrounded by such an amazing group of educators so that I'm literally learning and getting better every second that I'm here. Um, from the literacy teachers to the math teachers to the history teachers and our pretty incredible Spanish teacher, just um, learning different practices and learning from people all the time. Um, in addition to that, we try to push ourselves even more with PD days throughout the year, but really most of the development and the learning happens from each other in the school building. But she just has to wake up every day and meet Veronica Bryant, and I have to live with that too. Amira Keaton, I'm really sorry. Every day of your life, you live as Amira Keaton. Um, in general, instruction is a huge focus of the school. I mean, it's what drives the kids' academic success, and we have a huge focus on not just having an extended day, but using every minute of it purposefully. So we have built-in planning meetings to the day, um, depending on your department. We have built-in planning from 4 o'clock to 6 o'clock on either Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday, and another day for co-implementation, where teachers get to work with their co-teachers to really comb through the lesson plan and decide how they're going to use every second. Um, all decisions are made as a team once a week in our weekly meetings and when there's a problem, I mean, it sounds so cliche, but literally we all work together until it's solved, and um, that's probably my favorite thing about being here.